Hey everybody, it is Coach Tanya. I hope you are having a wonderful Saturday. I have had a very busy morning. As you can see, I'm still in my sweaty workout clothes, but the dogs needed to be groomed today. So I figured once I was done doing quarter force and getting sweaty in the garage, which video will come later, I wanna show you guys one of my favorite moves from today's workout. Um, I figured I might as well just go ahead and groom the dogs. So I set the table up, got them all groomed, got them all bathed, and now they're all hanging out in here with me waiting for some of their treats. Um, so I wanted to chat with you guys why I was enjoying my lunch today. Normally this is my snack, as you all know, but it was a very busy day. Um, you know, I had my breakfast, did my team call, and then I wanted to work out, and I don't like to drink my Shakeology before working out. So I figured I'll just have it for lunch. We have Ryan's party today and stuff like that, so it's okay if my, my meals get pushed back a little bit. Um, but what I did want to talk to you guys about was who surrounds you. Um, because it's very, very important to be very aware of who is surrounding you in your life because you do tend to, what lizard is it? Um, a chameleon, I think it is. So we tend to be like chameleons and we tend to be like the people we surround ourselves with. So if we are surrounding ourselves with a lot of negative people, you're gonna tend to become a negative person yourself. Sorry, I'm organizing my desk while I talk to you guys because everybody just kind of puts their stuff everywhere. So. Um, if you make sure that you don't surround yourselves with those types of people, um, you should be A-OK -okay with, with your mindset and things like that. But it is a very, very hard thing to do because sometimes the people that are negative in our lives can be our family. And it's really hard to push family off. Um, trust me, I know. So I just wanted to talk to you guys about all of this and to make sure that you are aware of who you are surrounding yourselves with. And I also wanted to talk to you about making changes. So if for some reason you are surrounding yourself with people that might tend to be a little more negative or things of that nature, um, even if it is family, you might have to either talk with them and open up their eyes to the type of person that they are, or you might have to, um, I'm, I'm multitasking, there was something in my planner I needed to make sure I highlighted so I wouldn't forget for next week. Or you might need to, um, not hang out with them as much. And that's a hard, hard decision to make. Um, so, but before I go any further, I just wanted to say, you know what time it is. It shows some love time. That means press that share button, guys. Okay, so back to what we were talking about making the decisions and focusing on who is around you. So if you wanna make a change in your life, if you feel like everything in your life has been negative or all bad things happening and things like that, and you want better things to go on, you want your life to be more positive, things like that, then you're gonna to have to make some hard decisions and you're going to have to do some tough things. So my first thing when I stepped out of the box is um, I really thought about each person that I spend the majority of my time with and was really honest with myself about that person. Do they help lift me up? Do they have me focus on the good in situations? So like say I call somebody up because I'm having a rough day. Do they just agree with me and go with the negative or do they try to change my mindset and make me more positive? Because we wanna be around the people that are gonna help us look for that positive and help us learn how to make the change within our own mind. It's a very hard thing to do. One thing that really helped me with this was some personal development. Um, and my favorite book about this was um, You Are a Badass. Great, great book. Um, I can actually show it to you so you know who the reader is. This book. Great book on raising yourself up, getting yourself a lot more motivated. Um, I see that you guys are on here, but comment something, because for some reason when we go live on our like pages, it's totally different than when we go live on our personal page, and it doesn't tell me exactly who joined, but it tells me that there's a lot of people on. So say a quick hi or something so I can say hi back. I like to say hi to you guys, but it doesn't tell me when you join like it normally does, because normally as you guys join, I would welcome you and say hi, so it makes it a little bit harder. Um, so that's a great book to read to help with um, positive mindset and to help remind yourself how wonderful you are. So I just wanted to quickly come to you guys and uh, mm, love it. Today I made mango madness. It's green only because I put power greens in it, which gives me extra greens into my diet. Um, I just wanted to come to you guys and remind you guys to focus and see who is actually surrounding you and make sure it's the people that you want around you. 
I want you to have a great rest of your Saturday. I'm finally gonna go take a shower so we can leave this house in about an hour and go party for Ryan's 13th birthday. Have a wonderful, wonderful day and I will check back with you guys later. Bye.